Hello and welcome back to my Minecraft Dota Survival series, where in this episode a new Snapchat has come out and we're and I'm I'm really excited because uh, a lot of stuff has happened. Um, a lot of exciting stuff. First of all, I don't know if you can hear it, but let me just uh, do. Oh, it's already at max. I think you can hear it. If not, let me just do this. Yeah, that's the game. That's not me adding anything. <laughs> they have added 95... 95... Listen to that. 95 ambient sounds to the nether. 95 ambient sounds to the nether. And they play different sounds in each nether biome. So that is... Really cool. And I would get creeped out if I didn't know better that there are only the monsters that are here and not anything else creepy. If this was a mod pack, I would be freaked out and I would run through that portal. <laughs> so that's a thing. They've also added a bunch of other stuff or changed a bunch of stuff like textures and whatnot. But one specific thing. Well, two actually. One, uh, when we actually start getting into netherite and stuff like that, we can no longer just make it in a crafting table. We actually need a smithing table in order to make netherite armor and tools. And a smithing table is four wood and um, two iron. So, yeah, iron is a thing. So that is a thing that we will have to... Well, we already need it as of now. Now we need it even more if we want to do stuff with netherite. Um, but one thing that I, that I think got changed, but I never actually took advantage of, I think I forgot. Um, is that hoes, a hoe, a hoe, uh, breaks these, like, leaf blocks pretty fast? Yeah. They break them pretty fast. And so now, I actually want to take this thing down, because it's, it's annoying to look at, okay? It's ugly to look at, so I kind of want to take this down. Um... I think it's about time. I really hope that they make it so these things decay on their own. I really, really hope that. Because that would be really, really cool. Um, but yeah, while I'm doing that, another thing that we're going to be doing today. Well, first off, they changed a little bit of the bartering. Speaking of which. Uh, yeah, it's right there. Um, they added... Piglins can now offer soul sand and iron nuggets. So that just made bartering a whole lot more efficient. Uh, more, sorry, more important, but also piglets no longer offer shroom lights, warped nilium, nor warped fungi, which is really cool, because that is more stuff that I don't, that's, that's stuff I didn't need anyway, so <laughs> for me that's great. Um, yeah, and also netherite hoes are now less common when bothering with them, so that's interesting as well. But another thing that should have been changed is the Huglins shouldn't despawn when they have been, um, when you, what's it called? When you, um, breed them. They should no longer actually, uh, despawn. So that is what we will be doing today. Now I will perform a small test today as well to see if they can actually leave the Crimson Forest. If they can, I will have to lead them over here to the thing, but if not, I will actually have to move the, um, I'm actually gonna place this thing here. I will actually have to move that fence over there. That sound is creepy, man. <laughs> I will have to move the fencing over there that we made, like, episode two, um, to a crypto forest, basically, where there are, are hocklets. So we will test that today, as soon as I have this thing taken care of. Now, I don't have any gold, unfortunately, to, um, to get, r to, to bother with the piglin. So that will have to do, get the, ow. We will have to do that another time. But let me just remove this, and we will then see if we can find some hucklins. Because if we can get a steady pork chop supply, then food is no longer, like, an issue at all. Like, that's gonna be really, really cool. 
Now, I forgot, what do these things actually breed using? Crimson fungi. So, they're bred using crimson fungi. Do I have any of that? Because I will need it, obviously. Um, let's take a look if I got any crimson fungi. Okay, so it is... Wait, what? This is not... F is it? I need... I need fungi. That's not fungi, is it? I th I think it is. It might just be the wiki being a little bit off. I'm not sure. Um, but I think it's this. I think it's this. But we will go and get more. And hopefully we will find some hucklins over at the Crimson Forest over here. Um, should we check at the mushroom farm? You know what? Let's check at the mushroom farm when we're done. And let's see how much it has grown. But anyways. Man, these ambient sounds. They're good. <laughs> they're creepy. They do what they're supposed to. But yeah, let me get over to the Crimson Forest here and let's see if we can find some Hawklins and see if they can leave the Crimson Forest. Alright, here we are. Nothing so far. Gotta be a little bit careful with that cliff there. Give me some more of these. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is what it is. Unless it's this weird grass. Nope, it's roots. Alright, let's head over here and uh, let's see if we can get a Huglin to follow us. Eh. Get up here. Alright, so there's some right there. Plus a baby, actually. Hey, buddy. Are you gonna follow me? Could you follow me, please? Oh, two of them. Uh, uh, uh. Come on. Come on. You got this. You got these. Now I know these are babies, so they're not that useful to me, but I want to see if they can leave. Oh, they they can. Can they? Oh, yeah, they can. They certainly can. This one does anyway. Okay, that's good. Hey, we could get a uh, we could get we could get a farm now. Yay! I'm so happy. <laughs> now, of course, I will need more than this baby. I need to actually be able to breed them. So, and also, I'm not happy with how it is currently. I will actually have to expand the, um, wait, where did that guy come from? Follow me, please. Oh, no, lava, 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 lava. Nope, nope, don't need you, don't need you right now. Nope, actually, stand back. Please stand back. <laughs> heal, heal, stay. Bad Hoglin. Bad. Bad Hoglin. Bad. Stay. Okay. Actually, okay, keep following me. <laughs> that was a moment of crisis. Uh, follow me, follow me. But yeah, as I wanted to say, I'm, I do want to actually make their home um, more comfortable. So it's not just this small place here. I do want to make it bigger as well. So you're going to have to get up here somehow. Now you're burning. Good job. They're not they're not fireproof, alright? Hopefully you won't die from this. Come on, buddy. You got this. Fine, you don't got this, obviously. <laughs> they do hit hard though. They do hit hard. Come on. Up you go. Up you go. Come on. Okay, 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 okay. Yep, 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 yep. Nope. Wait. Come on, buddy. This is a bit tricky, but it's not impossible. Oh, this thing is... There we go. Go through. I don't think it can actually get through that one gap. No, it can't. It needs a big gap. Okay. Can I just remove this? No. Need to actually get rid of this. Then it will. Then <laughs> get around, place this, and place that. Aha! We got one. Oh, yeah. Okay. Whew. Okay, well then. We got one. Okay, so... I need another one. And hopefully it won't despawn. Can I just do that? Maybe it won't respawn now? I, I, I don't know if it's when they have actually uh, done their thing. But, I don't know. We'll have, to, we'll have to see. Let me make a bunch more mushroom stew. 
because just just so I don't run out in this mission. And I saw some over there, so let's try and get another one. This lava is deadly. Please stop it. Please stop it. You're very mean and making my life harder. So I'm just gonna push you back. Like I saw two over here. Ow! What did I just say? Uh, no, nothing here. Okay, so that means they do despawn, unfortunately, still, just like that. I feel like they despawn a little bit too often. Um, but we'll see, we'll see. Don't actually need the, the Crimson Fungus out, but that is apparently what they breed with, so that's good. Good to know. I need another adult one. And it's uh, if it's on the other side of this, it's gonna be a pain to get back here. Oh, looks like looks like it got dated. Let's see. We got in. I see one over there. That's gonna be a pain, but I'm gonna do it anyway, cause we need it. Oh, this is gonna be a big pain. And I don't have enough um, netherrack to do this. All right. I don't know if this is going to do the trick, but um, hopefully it will. I'm just gonna extend this a bit more. Oh. If I can get two, I mean, that's plus. Oh, they're going up, all right. Let's hope they can actually navigate this thing. The issue with having two here... Oh, dear. Is because uh, one is going to get behind the other. And now they're stuck. I think I'm going to have to push you a bit, maybe. Ow. Okay, that they hit hard. They hit hard. All right, come on. Okay, you, you fight that one. Buddy. Excuse me, boy. I don't have it. Okay, get up here. Come on. Okay, I can tell this is going to be a big pain to do. <laughs> oh, here, here, here it comes. Okay. Hey, buddy. Come on. I got a friend waiting for you. Hopefully waiting for you. Oh, watch out. That's a... What on? Okay, fine. I'll take these two. <laughs> that apparently just spawned in. Hey, guys. Hello. Oh, no. Hey, guys. Hello. Ah, don't hit me. Don't hit. Don't hit. Don't. Don't you dare. Bad boy. Bad. Bad boy. Very bad boy. Very bad boy. <laughs> this way. And I think I lost their attention. Oh, come on. This is more difficult than it's... <laughs> okay. Hey, guys. Okay, I'm just gonna... Oh, there's a baby here. Smack you down. And you guys have to then follow me. Okay, just one of you. That's fine. One of you is enough. And the baby can follow if it wish. Uh, they have a weird navigation AI. If you... I can't deal with you. I'm sorry. But you're just in the way. Eh, get out of here. Another one. I think it's just the navigation that their AI that is just bad. I honestly think so. Like, come on. There you go. Maybe they have been able to leave the Crimson Forest all the time. I guess like it gets stuck and you have to free it all the time before it can move again. Like, look at that. This trip is going to be a difficult one. Very difficult one. I have to almost manually move it without actually being able to do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's straight forward now. Straight forward. Pretty much straight forward. Come on. This way. That's right. Okay, I think we got this now. I think we got it this time. Thing is, I don't have to run. It's not. It's just as fast as me. Actually, I'm a bit faster, it seems. So that's good. I just gotta, just gotta keep calm. Not fall in the lava this time, and we should get this guy home. Now, hopefully, they walk slow on soul sand as well. Otherwise, I'm gonna have a issue. Come on, buddy. Come on. You got this. Oh wait, can't they? Can they? Not? Oh, they can jump that. They can jump that. Yeah, they can jump that. <laughs> Okay, I actually wanted to go that way. Don't walk in the lava, you dumb dumb. Oh, 
Is it still up there? Yeah, it's still up there. Okay, perfect. It's still up there. Good. It hasn't despawned. And I think... No, don't... Be a dumb and get hurt. You've already been hurt quite a bit. By me. <laughs> Alright. Now, don't burn like your other dude. Oh no, not what I need, gas. Gas, not what I need. Not what I need. Not what I need right now. Please go away. Die. Go home. Ow. Huh? 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 No. Okay. I think I got an idea for this place to keep it safer, but... Uh... Don't tell me it's free. Nope, it's not. Okay, good. I need that gas gone ASAP. I think I might have to use my bow here. No, oh, it's burning. No. Don't die. You gotta be kidding me. And it's, it's gonna die. Okay, I'm just gonna have to run. That ghast. That's it. That is it. I'm using my bow. This thing is almost dead, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no. Finally. Okay, you gotta not hit me, and it died. It died. Ah, stupid ghast. Well then. Alright. You wanna get in? Eh. Nope. Nope. Eh. Leave. That's one. Look at my health. <laughs> uh, this is hard work. If that stupid gas had not been here. Everything would have been fine, and we would have had two hoglins, but nope. Are you... I'm so done with you, Pete. You flying squids. <sighs> they wreck everything. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get you a f friend again. Hopefully, one spawned nearby. Oh dear me. I got good news though, there's one right here. If I can just get it down somehow. Then I think it really wants to say hello. Took a bit of fall damage there, but I think it'll be fine. <laughs> it better be fine. I have another scare spawns. I already used two or three of my arrows. I don't want to do that. Only when I absolutely need to. I should have done it before, obviously, then then it might have had a bigger impact. But uh, let's get this last guy over. Hopefully, yeah, the other one hasn't despawned yet. We gotta breed them, then we should be good. I think it literally burned to death. I don't think that it despawned. I just, I honestly just think it, it died. Now, this is gonna be a bit interesting, because... I got two now that I have to get in there. And my methods that I used before won't actually work again, so... I also need to make this a cage so the piglins won't actually go, go ahead and harm these things. And I think I need to go home and make a second fence in, because otherwise this is not gonna work. So... If you will just, like, stay out here. Just... Please don't despawn. Alright. Don't go anywhere. I need more fence. <laughs> need more fence. Where did it go? Oh, right here. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. This way. Woohoo. Yeah, I need these guys to not attack it. Okay, so I need this out of here. I need to place on this. Leave a two space opening. Uh, Need another fence gate. Oh, you're burning. No. 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 
no. <laughs> Just no. Not when there's only one that's the threat here. No. Not happening, buddy. Not happening. Would have been cool if he had dropped the crossbow when I finally did attack one. Uh, do I have... No, I do not have a fence gate. Need a fence gate. Need a fence gate. Eh. I also need more wood. Do I have more wood? I only have that. Uh, okay, fine. I'll worry about wood later. Worry about wood later. Come on. Yeah, don't you dare touch this thing. Got it? I will kill you. Alright. Fence gate. Ha, gotcha. Got both of them. Okay, now I just need to get rid of this. Probably gonna lose some fence here, because not gonna be able to get in. And I only have one uh, fungus now, but I can go back to my garden and get this ex the extra one that I have. Just like so. And breed them. And we should be in business. Alright, we should be in business. You get one, and you get one. And this should be made a baby huggler. <laughs> Hopefully, and we should have a reliable source of food. Ow! If you would, how did you get in here? <laughs> Carrots and the bats. <laughs> I wouldn't call it that, but uh, ow. Okay, so apparently we have a pigman in here. That's quite all right. Okay, um, I need to fence this area in a lot better. You know what? I'm. I don't even. Yeah, this thing is gonna come after me now, isn't it? Um, yeah, I need some more netherrack to do this. Hold on. I need a lot more of everything, to be honest with you. I need... Not that. I need to remove all the fence gates. I need to... Uh, get... You in there. And I need... Shush. I need to get... Let me see here. Let me do as much of this stuff, hold on. Alright, I got netherrack and I got uh, crimson fence to surround this thing with. And I'm not sure how I'm actually going to be able to kill them and get what they drop. I, I think it should be pretty easy to do, just break some of the fence at the top and uh, should be good. But yeah, let me surround. Ow. That was the baby that hit me. Ouch. Now the baby will actually be able to get through that, so that's... I'm not happy about that. Alright. At all. But it's fine. Okay, now the piglins should not be able to get in here and attack them. That is... this is... this one is for their own safety. And I just want to be able to get that out of the way. That's gonna despawn. That's alright. Uh, I want to move those over to the other corners and... I would love to get some crimson, um, like that crimson grass thing in there, which I think should be pretty easy, considering using bone meal. Just stick onto it, actually, and use it that way. So I think that is what we're gonna do. We've pretty much made a cage here. I think now I should be able to break this and replace it without the little guy running out. Perfect. Sweet. That's good. Now I just gotta break this. Boom, boom. Boom. And then gotta break this. Boom, boom. And boom. Alright. We got a cage for him. <laughs> uh, if I can get some more crimson wood. Do I have crimson wood down here? No, I need to grow some. But I think I will actually make the cage bigger. Uh, in height, and then put a basalt roof on it or something. I think that's going to be the best course of action. And it didn't seem like the gas fireball actually damaged this fence or broke it. So I'm just going to leave it be. I'll have to do some testing on that. But hopefully that won't actually be a thing that happens. Yeah, you guys just better keep it together, alright? But let me get some bone meal and that one red um, crimson nullium that I got and a bunch of bone box. I don't know how many I'll need but I'll need a lot. That should be good though. I can always get more bone blocks. They, they're easy to get. 
and let us it should just be as simple as breaking that one and then just bone mealing these parts really so that's very cool just like so boom boom well not really this one let's keep it like that and then just have to i think do this can i reach it if there's not a ton of huglins, I could reach it. I think I'm just gonna go with the fence and just do it like this. If I fall in there though, I'm dead. So I cannot allow myself to fall in there. Yeah, I know this looks weird. <laughs> that was so funny. Okay, finish this up and... I could do it from below, which I might have to do with... I wonder, will you hit me from up here? I don't trust that. I don't trust that one bit. I will have to trust that one bit. Uh, do that. I can reach, though. I can reach, so... That is good. I can do that. If you guys would just move, that would be so lovely. All right. What? What just? Huh? <laughs> what just happened? Why did they all get angry? I didn't do. What? On... <laughs> Wait, what? Is this something I don't know about? Hold on. <laughs> what are you guys? Ha! Huh, you can't open fence gates. I didn't do anything, did I? All right. Well, I mean. Yeah. I gotta get out of here, so... <laughs> Can't really do anything but, uh... Start punching. I mean, I'll get gold from this, so... It's not too big of a minus. I just need a couple swords. Let me just... Eh, let me make all four of them. I'll need them eventually. All right, this was not intentional, but I mean, I'll take it. Um, okay, I'll be right back. All right, well then. I mean, that was odd. They just all of a sudden got, got angry. Huh. Well then. Not sure why that happened, but, uh, won't complain too much, to be honest with you. <laughs> won't complain too much. All right, let me reorganize again. All right, well, let's see if they're still angry at me or if these are newly spawned. Oh, yeah, they can open doors. Okay. That's interesting. I'm not sure what on earth did that. But, um... I'll live with it. <laughs> Good thing they can't open fence gates. I don't think the pigmen can actually open doors. Or zombified piglins, as they're actually called now. Uh, eh, there we go. Cool. These guys got a little bit more. No. Are you kidding? They can break the fence. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. Okay. I think I know what we gotta do in the next episode. In the next episode, we are going to fortify this entire cave using crimson vines. Because if they work just like normal vines, monsters can't actually see through. And we have a ceiling pretty much the entire place. So just putting crimson vines all around this like ceiling at the edge that should stop guests from seeing us and shooting at us. So that's gonna get, we gotta collect some vines and stuff for that. So either in the next episode or a coming episode, we will have to do that. Cause um, yeah, this, this is getting a little bit too much. Also, we can't risk this blowing up. So that's a thing. But anyways, I think, where, how did you get here? I'll, t I'll take. I'll take an ender pearl if you drop one, buddy. 
fact, I might help you along. There he is. I might help this guy along. Oh, no end up hell. Oh well, it was worth it. <laughs> Gotta take the opportunity when you get it. But anyways, that was... I think that was that. Yeah. Just gotta keep breeding them and... Uh, wait, can I breed them already? Uh, let me see if I can get some more uh, Crimson Fungi real quick. Of course, now it spawns relatively close. I can't get another one in there right now. Well, to be honest with you, I probably could, but... No, just no. I'm just here. For some crins crimson mushroom fungi thingy thing. Alright, I got some more crimson fungus or fungi or whatever it's called. Just gonna get up here. Gotta give you one and give you one and I will guess that since they went into love mode again, that they might get another one? Let's see. If they do, well, that's really good. <laughs> and I got just gotta wait for the little guy to grow up. So, yep. It happened. Now, is there a cooldown? I wonder. Yeah, there is a cooldown. Okay, I don't know how that, how long the cooldown is. I assume it's like five minutes or something. Isn't that the default? I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. I think it's already 31 minutes long. Let's take a quick peek at our mushroom. Whoa. That's good. That's a good result so far. I like it. Yeah, I definitely will have to make this bigger. No. No. I'll definitely have to make that bigger, but that was good. Because it's going to take a while before I'm actually going to start killing those things for food. I'll have to see how long it takes for those to grow. Or at least when they grow. Because they're going to have to grow eventually. <laughs> But yep, I think that's gonna be it for this one. Very interesting with that pigment assault. Um, I don't know what caused that, but yeah, that was interesting. If anyone know why, let me know down in the comments below. But anyways, guys, that's gonna do it for this one. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day, and goodbye. Banting, you can